Have you ever made an impulsive bad decision? We all have. But on this particular video, I made a decision to go right instead of left, which led to several more difficult decisions. Well, first, let me set the stage for you. We're heading west on I-40 past Albuquerque to Torrance County Park, and it's a loop. We pull in at one end and stay the night. We woke up in the morning, 12 degrees outside, our first time camping in that cold of weather. And in the morning when we got up, we decided to leave camp. Well, instead of going back out the way we came in, I decided, well, let's finish the loop and see what else there is to this park. So we turned right instead of left. When we got to where we couldn't go any farther, and in this video, you can't tell how steep the road is and how rocky the ruts are, but we knew that there was no way we could take Nellie down it. So Brian looked to the right and saw this area where we could possibly turn, you know, briefly in and do a three-point turn. Unfortunately, <laughs> when we went to back up, this is what happened. Oh, get out. After making the decision to go all the way in, which of course was a, another wrong decision. How many point turns do you think we made? As you see here, Brian is telling me to go to the left, and yet again, I turn right.
So when a decision is made impulsively, and it turns out to be the wrong decision, what was the lesson to be learned from it? Was this impulsive decision because there was something to learn from? Was it because it was to challenge Brian and I's communication skills? Or maybe it was to delay us to keep us from getting an, into an accident down the road. I don't know. What I do know is we did get out of it. We still love each other. Nellie didn't come out of it unscathed. Her sides got scratched up pretty bad. Got the ice off the side of Nellie. Wow, 20 minutes later, we're finally back on the road again. squirrel.